castor oil. Castor oil, what the heck does castor oil do? You know, I remember hearing stories about how this used to be popular back uh, in my grandma's day. <clears throat> my parents would tell me about how their parents would, uh, you know, give them castor oil before bed. Or, um, you know, it's just, it, it's like an old school thing that people have forgotten about. Yet, you can still purchase it in CVS. Um, and there's, to my knowledge, two different ways to use it. it. It's, first of all, it's an extremely thick oil. It is super thick. It's very thick. It's gummy. Um, yeah. It, uh, and it has an interesting smell. Let's see if I can describe it for you. <laughs> Castor. I, I believe it comes from a plant, like almost kind of like a, cact, a cacti. Kind of, it comes from some kind of a plant. And um, as oil does. <laughs> and and it's, it's really thick. And it can be used as a laxative. Um, which is interesting, um, but I'm more interested in it because, uh, I started learning about this dude named Edgar Casey, and Edgar Casey was, a actually a psychic, um, that was popular, I believe, in the 1920s, and he had made a bunch of predictions. He was able to astral travel and visit the Akashic Records and, uh, you know, this is stuff that you got to think back in those days, hearing about that stuff was like no one that was such an underground thing to talk about the Akashic Records. Um, now, with the Internet, it's a little bit more. I'm not it's not mainstream, but, you know, it's widely available if people are interested and want to learn more about it. There's so much information online about every topic, even the weird, uh, more taboo things that how it used to be back in the day but the point being he talks about castor oil and how it actually can be absorbed through the skin uh and be healthy uh that way by being absorbed through the skin and the most beneficial place that he says for it to be absorbed through is actually uh into the liver uh so with these castor oil packs he calls them castor oil packs what you actually do is you get uh, you apply the castor oil to the area on your liver, and I'll, I'll put a picture up now so that you can, if you're not sure where your liver is on, on your body, it's kind of on the right side uh, below, your, below your breast, underneath your lungs, that's where the liver is. And he says to apply the castor oil to that area topically, uh, you know, on your skin, you rub in the castor oil on your skin, and then you heat it up to open up the pores with a heating pad. And that's supposed to, to, you know, detoxify and cleanse the liver. Interesting. Interesting concept. Um, I am not a fan of heating pads. I don't have it. Actually, I do have a heating pad, but I just don't like using it. And uh, I think I tried one castor oil pack my entire life. I was not a fan. However, I do like to take this. Uh, I usually stick it in my gym bag and I like to bring it in the sauna with me. And after my workout, I will kind of cover myself in castor oil <laughs> in the sauna because you're sweating out all those toxins and allowing the castor oil to go uh, into your body, which has some great healthy benefits. Um, I put it all over, not just my like the area of my liver, but <laughs> like a whole body pack. But, it, you know, and then you go in the shower and you wash it off and it's just. I feel like that's the easiest, most uh, effective way because I'm not trying to lay in bed with an oily bed and uh, an oily heating pad. I mean, I guess if you're sick and you can get relief that way, uh, that's an option. But, you know, that's, you know, that's my personal way that I like to uh, apply the castor oil. It's when you're inside the sauna and you're, you're already, your pores are open, you're sweating, uh, and then you can easily rinse off in the shower. So that's how I like to do it. But that's castor oil. Pretty cool stuff. Um, if you've never tried it, check it out. Uh, thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Learn something about castor oil. Learn something new every day. Uh, subscribe to the channel. I talk about a lot of different stuff, health stuff, um, uh, 
uh, technology stuff, anything that I personally use, I just want to give my two cents to the world. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.